Antiki partisans blew up railway in Odessa region on Wednesday. The explosion occurred at about 10 a.m. as the freight train was passing near the Stava 1 station. No one was hurt in the incident. Earlier, Antiki partisans blew up a car in the center of Odessa near Board of Public Safety Office. News of the explosion was reported by the head of public relations department of chief directorate of the Ministry of Internal Affairs in Odessa region, Vladimir Shablienka. Intensification of NATO activities at Russian borders causes concern at the Russian Defense Ministry, Deputy Defense Minister Anatoly Antonov told reporters on Wednesday. Under the slogan of Russian threat, NATO is building its military potential in the Baltic states, Poland, Bulgaria and Romania, the Deputy Defense Minister noted. He noted that the number of tanks was on the rise in Europe and activity of alliances aviation, which has now based in the Estonian city of Emery, grew sharply. We remember the number of flights by NATO tactical aircraft at Russian borders more than doubled this year, exceeding 3,000 flights. France, Italy, Austria and Hungary want to unfreeze relations with Russia, a diplomat said in an interview with TASS. According to him, European Union sanctions against Russia will be revived at the next meeting of the EU foreign ministers on January 19 in Brussels. Previously, EU foreign policy spokesperson Maya Kasiansik reported that the January meeting will focus on the development of a common European strategy toward Russia. Germany is on its highest level of terror alert since the 1970s, say security authorities in a report seen by Bild. It states that both lone perpetrators and self-sufficient small groups might be behind future attacks. We must assume that attacks of varying size and intensity are possible at any time in the Federal Republic of Germany, says a confidential report by the country's security authorities seen by Bild. According to the report, Berlin continues to be in focus of Islamist terrorist movements. The involvement of Germany is in on the ongoing fight against Islamic terrorism had motivated such extremist groups. We thank our information partners for help with spreading this video news. Subscribe to our channel to receive up-to-date information on the situation in Ukraine and current geopolitical events in Europe.